When you are logging in to your Chromebook at home, you are going to use your Google credentials. You will type your student ID number and you will use the email address in the format listed on the screen. Then you will type in your password that is also considered your Google credentials password. Once you are logged into your device, there will be a page that explains how to type in the correct information to use your home Wi-Fi. Be sure to read this information so you know what to type when you get to the Zscaler page. Scroll down to see what you will type when you get to the Charlotte Mecklenburg Schools organizational page. Remember here is where you type your ID number at cms.k12.nc.us. Now you will type your ID number at cms.k12.nc.us with your birth date in the format listed on the screen. Now that you are logged in and your data is more secure, use the CMS bookmark tool to get to the student portal or the CMS homepage. You can click the bar to take you straight to the single sign-in login portal, or you can click students to gain access to the important links. I am now going to choose log in to Canvas. When I click log into Canvas, I do have to sign in with my student ID number into NC Ed Cloud. Type in the password you typically use when logging in to NC Ed Cloud. If you do not know your password, be sure to ask your teacher. Now that I am logged into Canvas, I can review my coursework by going towards my dashboard and clicking a course or by choosing courses and scrolling down to all courses to see each course that I am enrolled in.